All right, guys, time for another SGC reveal. It's uh, tuxedo time. Um, guys are really doing it right. I mean, you send them in at the $30 level. They come back from door to door, three weeks. From the time they get them till they're graded or, you know, max two days, it seems lately. So a little bit pricey for us Canadians, but I think it's cheaper if you go through a group submitter. So it's got a little eight-card personal review. I actually went to... Uh, show and picked up a couple of mosaic football because I wanted to see how SGC graded them compared to uh, PSA and I've had absolutely terrible luck with PSA and huge football guy so I said what the hell let's let's send a couple of uh, out to SGC and see what comes back so anyway I'll show you the results um, so weird with PSA because you really don't have any idea what kind of went wrong but and I also have a couple of hockey cards that I just kind of like pulled in uh, pulled here on the channel here for you guys but anyway we'll take a quick look so um this is how they come back so um lucas raymond sgc 10 i might sell that right away um i think you know right now is the time to sort of get max value for these cards but I really do like their slabs a lot and i like the like since they changed to the much simpler grading system they seem to have done nothing but picked up steam and they they sort of set themselves up as like the uh you know the the friendly sort of grading company where you know you can contact them i actually had some issues with this i i made a big goof you're supposed to print off um you're supposed to print off a receipt put it in the in the box when you send them away and uh you know and then they know what what it is when they get there and i just i forgot i mean it was ridiculous i mean a very rookie mistake but it's only my second submission i've sent in but I messaged them yep no problem let's track it down you know and and right away they started with communication like instantly within within probably four or five hours everything was sort of sorted out so we'll take that but on uh, also I'll take the 10 with Lucas Raymond and Kublik who kind of kind of good timing on him I wasn't sure if I was going to send it but I just sort of sort of like to send the hockey I don't have a Kublik right now so and I knew that was going to get a 10. So we'll take that all day. And then here's the, the football cards I sort of picked up. I probably paid uh, for these six cards around 20 bucks each on average. So we'll take that. So let's see. Uh, I'm kind of still high on this guy, Trevor Lawrence. I got an 8.5 and I knew when I sent it. I don't know if we can see down here. But uh, there is a little tiny ding. And when I sent it, I was like, oh, geez, I wonder if I should bother. But I kind of had the rainbow, so... I sent it anyway and it's slabbed and it's mine so what the hell we'll take it 8.5 another trevor lawrence blue reactive prism a 9.5 so I'm, I'm pretty happy to get a 9.5 um it's sort of they've sort of overtaken bgs as far as uh people enjoying them the, the, the value's not quite there but you're getting close so anyway there's trevor lawrence 9.5 we'll take that and then i got four mac jones so nice mac jones green prism probably going to be the best quarter i mean he's in the best situation of any quarterback out of this this class so we'll take that all day and i love mosaic like i love it it's my favorite product actually and I'm a huge football guy, so. And then we got our nice 9.5 Orange Reactive Mac Jones. So we'll take that. I mean, 9.5, there's, there's nothing really you can look for that, that you wouldn't know. And then we got a nice pink 10. Nice, sort of what everyone's looking for. And, and I, I equate these to the equivalent of the BGS 9.5s, the SGC 10s. So we'll take that all day. And I might have a little little something in the back here, even though I'm not a New England fan of them. I'm a Mac Jones fan. And the blue, which is actually my favorite. My favorite one. It's pretty tough with football. There's so much uh there's so much um how can I say it? Uh different parallels and stuff that you uh kind of you kind of get lost in them. I, I don't think I could ever complete a rainbow because there's just too darn many of them. Every every single different blaster and package and everything else sort of has it. But uh, quick recap: we got uh, eight cards. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-
four tens. Hockey seems to grade much better. Four tens. Three nine point fives. And an 8.5, which I sort of knew, but I sent it anyway. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in.